get that space, of course. Mm. We hold to the top left. I see you, Superman. Right. Oh, get out of here, oh. No clue. It ain't no leg day right now. It's still arms. Hello, and welcome to round two of the Multiverses Pro Player Showcase. I'm your host, the Purple Sharpie. Today, we have a matchup comprised of two established fighting game community competitors and content creators, paired with some of the strongest players inside of the technical test. Let's go ahead and get into it. Team one is comprised of Team Spooky, who will be using Shaggy, and Leviathan, who will be using Velma. Team two will be comprised of Apology Man, who will be using Tom and Jerry, and Brokir, who will be using Superman. Since we got a Superman in the mix today, let's get over to our Superman super fan, IFC Yipes, and co-commentator, Ajax. All right, it's time to get into that multiverses action. I'm, of course, Ajax, joined by the one and only IFC Yipes. And we're going to talk about the four players who are going to showcase some amazing gameplay here for multiverses today. Absolutely, man. This man needs no introduction. Spooky, the spookster, of course, all over at Team Spooky on his Twitch channel. Uh, uh, streamed the legendary tournaments across the board for many years. I'll have to say like 15 plus, even more, to be honest. Man, I'm dusty. But anyway, <laughs> uh, <laughs> definitely been showcasing a lot of legendary stuff uh, from the FGC in general. And known for being a great competitor, too, in his respect for game. So I'm glad to see him here. 100%. We respect the foundation that was built before us, the ground that we stand on today. And part of that also comes from Leviathan, his teammate, one of the best players we have seen from the playtest. He has showcased so many incredible combos, so many incredible plays that we're going to get everybody to see today. And they're going with the theme team. We got Velma and Shaggy to start things off. But on the other side of it, you got Brokir and Apology Man. Of course, you know a little something about Apology Man. Yeah, so Apology Man, you know, the greatest meme walking on Earth, which is crazy. He <laughs> likes eating uh, warm milk with cereal. This guy's a weirdo. But what's not weird is his gameplay, even though he does play a lot of the oddball characters, of course. But that's what makes Vinith Vinith. And, of course, that is Apology Man. So it's good to see him here. And, of course, been in uh, multiple top eights for Evo and just won a ton of tournaments on his northern side in California and just everywhere in the world, really. So it's pretty cool to see him here as well. And a champion in his own right, Brokir, the best Superman we have seen. I know you're ready to see this. You're going to be stealing all of the moves that he pulls off, all the tech. And we're going to be seeing that teamed up with Tom and Jerry. That team up is going to be very strong of a zoner-based character and a bruiser leading up with a good point control. A lot of armor, a lot of zoning going into this match. So one thing I, uh, I love about Brokir's uh, Superman is mm -hmm. a simple fact that I stole all his tech. So uh, <laughs> uh, when, I, when I was actually playing this game and you guys were telling me, hey man, you need to use this guy's reference, I did and definitely showed me a lot. So I like the meta that he uses where he uses body armors with like uh, fo uh, forward attack, he holds it. And if you try to attack, he'll like weave and get a punish and stuff like that into a big mm -hmm. uh, combo. So I like the meta game behind the armor, uh, the armor behind his move. So pretty fire. Yeah, it's almost its own form of armor dashing the way he does it. Get it? Like, it doesn't start in the initial frames, but you're too scared to challenge that because Superman has armor on everything he's charging, and you got to hold that. And you might be holding that here as we start things off on the first game of Player Showcase number two. Let's see how Apology Man starts the zoning game off. He's putting that pressure on. You see a Brokir over on the right trying to challenge it. But on the other side of the red team, they're going to zone a lot with Velma, and Shaggy's going to be taking that point there on the side of Spooky. But what I what I love first and foremost, uh, before we even get to the gameplay, this just looks like a family barbecue to me. <laughs> so this is pretty dope that we get to see this. I can't wait for the offline side of things as well. So I'm pretty excited for this. Look at the Superman. Yo, we already got the ledge, of course. And Leviathan just fighting for his life over there. Meanwhile, Spooky coming to try to break it up. You always have to watch out for that giant beam that she has because she's able to get a weakness buff on you, which increases your damage you take. And also she could call the cops. You gotta run away from that. Mr. Jenkins is currently on Superman. <laughs> Now what? It's gonna scoop you up. It's gonna take you out. <laughs> Brokir did it right. Stalled away from that and did not get caught. <laughs> oh my God! All right. Okay, we get us some space here. Look at. I like how they hold in both of these sides too. But then it gets scrambly all of a sudden. But I like that though. Oh. It, looks, it looks chaotic, but trust me, it makes sense. Oh my God! I promise you. Oh, nice, nice up attack. Get the hell out of my. Get roofed. Yeah, amazing job right there. And when it comes to chaos, chaos controlled is Tom and Jerry. We're talking about the collateral damage. Look at the way the Podge Man can challenge that. Going for the down air, going all the way up to catch the frying pans to take him out. And before you saw how he's in the middle of the entire fray, that's just what he could do. His hitboxes are great. Yikes, like, Blue Team's got a pretty solid start here. Oh yeah, all right. Listen, I'm a big fan of Brokir right now. I like how he knocked him up in the air and then went for the neutral attack just mm -hmm. to get some, uh, you know, pile some damage on the percentages just to so get the easier knockdown, the knockout. 
And you see what he's doing a second ago. He was doing the, the down neutral attack into the jump cancel dare so he could keep that pressure going. And he has a projectile shield on him at the moment, but it's gone. Meanwhile, Spooky going off stage, but because Spooky went off stage to try and go challenge the Superman recovery, he got caught by the down air from Tom and Jerry. That's true. Oh, get scooped. Throw him in the laundry oh, shoot. No. Yes, yes. Uh-huh. Down attack all day. I like that. What? What? Let's that was a game? That was the game. These are shared lives. They only have four lives in total. In the moment that they're gone, that's it. So that's why you have to be careful. You're trying to go off stage and help your teammate. You might get cooked for it. Let me talk about the family barbecue. They was cooking. And a big reason why was that offstage play. He was canceling off the wall. He kept going for downers over and over again. And if, even if you got by that, Apology Man sitting up top waiting for you. Listen, man. That First off, that was bars. Second... Uh, Spooky and uh, Leviathan, they got the Gluteus Maximus kick. They definitely need to raise that difficulty setting. That was pretty cool, though, man. You know, at first, I like how everybody just scrambles to just, try to, uh, mm -hmm. just to get that high percentage, just to, just to assess the situation. You'll notice once they're high on the percentage, everything just slows down, so you can actually catch the gameplay. So I see what's going on here. I see that everybody's no, yeah. a very popular pick, and everyone has the Frosty buff. That Frosty buff gives you access to slowing people down by hitting them with a projectile. When you have Tom and Jerry, you're using that triple dynamite perk to set that up so you can get more. And then what does Superman come, uh, get to do? Come in and drop the Frost Breath and get those stacks going quicker so people are moving slow. Same side on the other side too, but it's easier for the blue team to set it up. Let me see. Let me get. Let me get a little more locomotive charge. You know, I, I, me as playing as Superman, that's not like a move that you really get to see. Mm -hmm. But I like seeing people get duffed out. That's just. That's it, just me. That's it a personal great. favorite. <laughs> it, it's it's so it's good too when you have a zoner on your team like that. But so many deep. Look how many deep buffs are around this team. This would be good if you have a cleanse type archetype on your team. If you have seen a Wonder Woman, but it doesn't matter because Procure is swinging. He was looking to take him off the top. Leviathan can't save Spooky right now. Spooky trying to get back down to ground. The Ice. <laughs> they, uh -huh. they are struggling. <laughs> yeah, no, they're struggling. But I'm loving Kyle L right now. He's getting pressed by Velma. We found the clues. Call the popo -po police. Have him on speed dial. Get him off for of me. That is the best thing that could happen to him. Because of the fact that the cop is going on to Superman, they can stall. If that was going on to Tom and Jerry, that means that they don't get the zone and they get to 2v1 the Superman because Tom and Jerry's too busy trying to run away. Yo, not for nothing. I can't believe I'm commentating the platform right now. This <laughs> a platformer? Hello. Okay, let me see something spooky. I'm a big fan. You know I'm a big fan. Everybody that's watching this video is a big fan. Mm -hmm. Oh, we're almost getting roofed. Oh, Watch it. Oh, that's a lot of resources gone for Spooky. And he's going to... Oh, wow. He actually got underneath that. But meanwhile, Leviathan going in to save him using the up air's giant light bulb. She thinking. Mmm. We out of the frying pan. We cooking. This is a family barbecue. That's bars. I see you, Ajax. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, now mm. they're gonna need a new recipe. They're gonna need one fast, but there that can do it. Oh, the psychic didn't get the KO. That's a lot of resources gone, but because of the command grab, you snatch him up, you get back on safely. They look as smooth though for the high percentage. They got that good health insurance for sure. Hey, you already know that's a little too expensive around these parts right here, and it's gonna cost Velma off the top. It might cost Spooky too. Spooky running. He trying to evade taxes. He not trying to fight. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta spend to, to in order to keep your money, huh? Okay. All right. Oh, Ooh, get out of here. What? Incredible snipe. Using uh, using the beam to go ahead and catch him off the side. And the slow debuff coming in clutch there for uh, the red team over Superman. Because Superman wasn't able to fly in quick enough to actually punish with that uh, command grab he was looking for. Meanwhile, Apology Man has been stock tanking. He's at 144 running, but putting out so many hits that Velma really can't challenge him right now. Yipes. Bro, look at Leviathan's movement. This movement is just immaculate. Just avoiding all danger. Keeping that percentage nice and low. Definitely looking for those baits. I see the full season here. Yeah, that, oh my goodness. So Sh Shaggy's normally so good at being able to challenge people with his high priority using his shield, especially when he has a rage. You can't do that in front of Superman. Superman always has a hitbox. This is a 2v1 opportunity though, but they backed off. You can't, this matters so much. This two to two can disappear so fast because everybody is getting near KO percent and they could find that KO real soon on Superman. Mm-mm. Oh, we in the scramble. Get up out of there. I see you, Kyle L. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Smoothments, indeed. The beams. I like the movement off of the beams. You know what's crazy? You can snipe with the beam and then actually go for a, a up attack, mm -hmm. which is pretty good. You got to catch it, though. Good snipe if you actually see the reset. Yeah, getting, posi uh, getting position for. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay. You putting out the dynamite there mattered so much because if Apology Man got caught by one of those forward airs or the up air, Spooky was waiting on the top to capitalize with the flying psychic. Mm -mm. There's no buildings here, Superman. All air. He, right, he gonna tear it down. 
Oh, everybody aiming for Spooky. I would have done the same thing, man. Smart move there from Brokier. And apology, man.